This is Pony Prepper Bill. Uh, today I'm going to do a quick thing on a uh, quick video on the chickens. The coop's pretty much all done. Uh, we went last Monday and got some chickens. I wanted some older chickens. These are a lot younger than I wanted. But everybody is sold out and you had to get babies. So we got six cinnamon queens, one black. Austria loop or lorp or something like that and the other one I'm not I'm not sure all right open her up that's what we got oh they're resting we're hoping that's the rooster maybe that's a rooster we don't know But we did get some baby chicks uh, last Monday. Let's take a look and see what we got here. Hey girls. Hey girls. What are you guys doing? Peep, 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 peep. I had it set up a little bit different. Got a heat lamp for at night if they get cold because the temperatures have been going down a little bit. Put them in here and of course I had to get a heat lamp because they're they said they were four to five weeks old I think they might be younger than that I'm not sure but I got plenty of ventilation in here which I think I've shown before but it got cold so I had the heat lamp in there but everything I did was to predator proof it I felt bad we had you know I put the blink cameras in there so we could keep an eye on them but the problem is, when the light came on, it attracted gnats and mosquitoes. And they were, like, attacking the frickin' chickens. And I felt so bad. So I was out here trying to cover stuff up. Um, I was going to cut uh, a window screen, you know, because we took a screen out for the window unit air conditioners in the house. But from one of those uh, I've seen on TV... The, the door screens, I found one of them in my garage. We bought a couple of them and they suck. So I ended up cutting that and I had to put, I don't know if you can see it. I had to cut, yeah, I'm gonna have to go on the inside. This whole thing's still a work in progress. Let me open this up. I had everything out, was working on it yesterday. And it's supposed to pour for the next three days, so I had to put all the wood and stuff in here. But up here, if you can see it, I had 
the hardware cloth, the metal, but then there's, I don't know if you can see it, this, you should be able to see at the top, that and that, that's the screen, that window mesh screen for your doors that hang and they snap together with magnets, they suck. But I had it taped up there temporarily, but the tape kept falling off. So some of it I had to just put wood with screws. Uh, and I ended up changing this. I had this box. This is the nesting box here that I made, which is full of all my tools. But I had this sloped up to keep the chickens off of it. But I figured this is a good place to keep food and treats and stuff. I know we gotta put something because the chickens are gonna jump up here. But I had all this, so it had plenty of ventilation. Had ventilation in the front, ventilation in the back. I got this that can open and close. I had to put screen on here. The top I had open. And the back. But the mosquitoes and gnats were just pew. So I had to come out here and fill all this stuff in the back. What a pain in the butt. So we had them since last Monday. Today is Saturday. But yesterday, I wanted to clean the, uh, clean the coop. I had roosting bars and stuff in there. One of the, the black rooster, I think he's a rooster. I'm not sure, but we might have two roosters, which is not good. They're too young to tell. But he was actually jumping up on the roosting bars, and I didn't want him to jump into the heat lamp, so I took the roosting bars out because they're too young for them anyway. I just got some 2x4 stuff in there for him. But yesterday I put a video, we put them, we took them out and put them in the run, the enclosed run. And they were running around having a good time. Let them out for like two hours and then put them back in because they cleaned the whole coop out and everything. But it's supposed to pour. It's supposed to pour like crazy. But this is what I got so far. Hold on. I put this. Of course, they're going to be completely enclosed in here. But I want to give them some more free range eventually, so I put this chicken, uh, this enclosure, but I think they're going to get through that, so I got to put some, that's a screen I was going to cut, but I'm going to run some four foot wire out there, so they got some room out there, and I saw somebody did something like this. This is just to keep the hawks, this rope and stuff is to keep the hawks from coming down. They need an easy way in and easy way out. So I had it pretty much cleaned up yesterday and had the wood all stacked up because I was still working on it. I got to build some roofs and stuff in here for them. Got a couple more weeks for that. But it was supposed to, it's supposed to pour for the next three days so. I put everything in here to try and keep some stuff dry. And that's what I got for now. And I'll keep you updated. I'll talk to you later.